Attorney General elect Russell Coleman is preparing to take office at the start of the new year. Today, he introduced his team, and Wave News reporter Sean Body explains why a new position in the office is focused on child exploitation. Russell Coleman will soon be Attorney General for the state of Kentucky, taking over for the current office holder, Daniel Cameron, on January 1st. A priority of his will be child exploitation cases stemming from his time at the U.S. Attorney's Office. He introduced the newly formed role of Deputy Commissioner for Counter Exploitation. We saw the predatory activity increase dramatically. And so it's important, not just symbolically for me, it's not just podium talk. I need someone to lead. There have been a number of new positions announced within the Attorney General's office, and Russell Coleman believes his office as a whole could as much as double in size in the new year. A big change coming for the department is the addition of the Child Support Enforcement Program, which is being moved over from the Cabinet for Health and Family Services. That's largely responsible for the increase in total staff. We've already had conversations with Secretary Freelander and the governor about the import of that. We, we just can't drop the ball. I mean, this is a broken system. We asked Russell Coleman about the idea being floated around by Republican lawmakers of a new state crime lab in Louisville. He didn't have a view, he said, to share on this, but added this. We have to ensure that our forensic science infrastructure is sufficiently funded, is large enough to respond so that we can prosecute cases. So, uh, it's, so we, we, we're in a situation now where the, the lab is underwater. Coleman was also asked about Ibogaine, a currently illegal psychedelic drug that some believe could treat opioid addiction. He said he'll be looking at all kinds of solutions. In Frankfurt, Sean Bowdy, Wave News.